Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm Michael Fulper. I'm an expert in the art of public speaking, pitching and presenting. So we're here at the lovely Dark Spaces studio and I'm with Ashley. Hi Ashley. Hi, kia ora. How are you going? Kia ora. I'm good, thank good, you. Good, good. So what are we talking about today? I see you have a range I of do. lovely gins again. Uh-huh. So today I thought we could have a bit of a charitable focus. Mm. It's not what you think. No, it's not you, giving not, it away you know. to all of you. I think it's good to just get that. Yes, yeah, no, yeah. it's about these distilleries and they are promoting different, um, race. basically they have a focus on what they want to um, help protect. Cool. Or, yeah, and so they give some of their donate, um, profits. I like the sound mm. of that. Let's walk us through it. Let's hear so, some more. let's start with Dr. Beak. Dr. Beak. Dr. Beak. So they have two in their range. Uh, so they are Martinborough based. Um, Where's Martinborough? Near, Wellington. near Wellington. Thank you. <coughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, they have two in their range. They've got their garden gin and their um, premium gin. The images on the front kind of, in a way, give away how the gin is. Uh, yeah. So you've got the cheeky Kia, so it's yeah, quite yeah. bold yeah, and yeah, um, yeah. punchy, yeah. I would say, this gin. And um, they have 13 different botanicals, so it's, wow. it's quite a lot going on there. It's, yeah, like I said, it's bold. Yeah. Uh, the garden gin um, has the pea waka waka, the fantail, and it is fresh and sprightly. That's Lovely. That's how they describe it. So just garden gin and... Premium gin. Premium yeah. gin. So what these guys do, Dr. Beak, they um, share some of their profits to basically different biodiversity. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, fundraisers, I guess. Yeah, and yeah. yeah, so that's just their focus on sustainability. That's very cool. Yeah. Nice, so, nicely done. Yeah, your. And, uh, yeah, both nice gins. And from a place near Wellington. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but just spe 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 yeah. specifically specify, yeah. Yeah. garden gin premium. So garden. When you I say would garden, say I would say the garden is probably more subtle, right? Than the premium because the premiums. Um, is garden a normal term? No, they've just they've created that themselves. Okay, good. Cool. Right. I'm just yeah. clarifying because yeah. there's boutiques, yeah, and stuff, yeah, you know. Hmm. Keeping up with the lingo. Hmm, exactly. Fantastic. Yes. Yeah, so that's the first two. Well done, um, beautiful. What else you got? Yeah, so um, the other New Zealand distillery that I have, this is a brand new one actually for us. What size are those bottles? They're 500 mils. 500 mils. They're very cute. Yeah, they are. Yes, yeah. yes they're yeah. lovely. Yeah, they are. Uh, Kakapo Distillery, they yep. um, are brand new to the Juniper Collective and actually brand new to the market. Mm. So they're not really stocked anywhere else at the moment, yeah. as far as I'm aware. Uh, so they're Auckland based. Right. Um, and the name kind of gives it away, Kakapo. Yep. So yep. They, um, so some of their profits go to the Department of Conservation, mm -hmm. um, their Kakapo recovery. Nice. Yeah. So their gin is Manuka honey and elderflower. Ooh, yeah, ooh, ooh. so it's quite nice. You have the outer flower comes through first, and then I find once you've sipped it, the um, manuka honey kind of kicks in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is it? Can you taste this at the uh, boutique? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Yes, you you can. took a moment to think. Like I did. Can, I was like, can you? Yes, yes, have yes, I opened one of these? I do have one of these open. Excellent. Yes. yes. So um, yeah, really nice and yeah. That's cool. Cockable. Wow. I mean, that's that's two brands that I didn't know that they supported things like yeah. this. That's fantastic. Yeah. Excellent. Um, my other New Zealand one, I'm actually out of stock, so I don't have here, okay. but I can tell you about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's in the courier waiting to get to me, I'm sure. Um, it is the Black Robin. So they um, are based in Tara, um, Tauranga, mm. and they are supporting, so each of their, they do other varieties other than gin, they do vodka, etc. Yeah. And so each of their um, different products are named after an endangered bird. That's cool. Yeah, and so they also um, a percentage of their profits yep. go to um, endangered birds. Who are they again? Black robin. Black robin. Where yeah. are they based? Tauranga. Tauranga. Mm -hmm. A lot of gin places spread out around New Zealand. Mm. They might end up with New Zealand has well, gin. Uh, yeah, I was just <laughs> thinking they might be end up with as many gin places as sheep. Yeah. What else you got? Right, last one that um, has, a, I guess, what we call a charitable status in terms of that it is sending some of their profits somewhere, yeah. um, other than their own pockets, mm -hmm. is <laughs> yeah. the Elephant Gin International. 
Right. So not New Zealand. Mm. Uh, Germany based actually. Mm. Um, but the elephant gin name probably gives away what they support and what they send 15% um, of their profits to. Wow. Supporting um, and basically yeah, elephants in Africa. Yeah, yeah. Different organisations there. Uh, so they have three in their range. So they have their slow, they've got their navy strength, mm -hmm. and then they've got their London drive. Navy strength. Mm-hmm. Yep. 57%. 57%? Yeah. yeah. That'll last you for a week. Yeah. Maybe. And I've got these little legs. Oh, maybe. I'm just ignoring him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving this. Like, um, yeah. That takes... So they've also, each of them has oh. a different little wee. Right. Right. On it as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And so these guys developed this gin after spending holidays in Africa yeah. and the ingredients come from Africa. Wow, so okay, that's cool. That's very yeah. cool. Hmm. So are these are these the, the major brands you know of that give back in this way? Yeah, so at yeah. the moment they're the ones that I know of. I'm sure there are others. Um, yeah, yeah. I guess some well, if there are, are others, let, let, us, let us know. know. Yeah. yeah, because yeah. I would love to support that and it's nice to get that out there because that's amazing. Yeah, yeah, if you yeah. can give a percentage of your profit to something, that's well, I mean, pretty incredible. We're getting gin and helping. Exactly, at the same time. Hey, yeah. You, can, you feel good in many ways. You can pass that on to your accountant. <laughs> <laughs> I'm helping. I am, yes. I'm helping support the elephants. Exactly. All the birds. All the birds. Elephants and birds. Yeah. I'm loving these. That's nice. Uh, what else have you got? I see so, that you've bought something. I have bought one other thing. Okay. Yeah, I know. I'm just bringing lots of yeah, 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 yeah. To... This is hard for me. I'm sitting here, like just passing all over to you. Here's here's something you won't see very often. Uh, what time is it? I've got, <laughs> no. I've got. <laughs> what time is it? Yeah. <laughs> what is it? Should we? Yeah. No. I've got water, so imagine my pain. Mm. Should I just? Yeah, 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 yeah. It'll look the same. No, yeah, it would. Um, no, so this is probably my latest favourite. Um, relatively new to the Juniper Collective. Mm -hmm. um, not new on the market though. Uh, they are Kiwi Spirit Distillery based mm -hmm. up in Golden Bay, in Takaka. Takaka. Yep. Uh, and the, this particular one is called Greenstone Gin. Um, yep. It's quite earthy. Yes. Bring in another word there for you. Yep. Uh, it has. Garlic. Yeah. So it's got uh, Totara and a few other botanicals like that in there. I can so make it. It's quite times like this, I can the, feel the teacher coming yeah. out on you. She looked at me like. Yeah. You, know, like, yeah, you should know what I'm talking about. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I also just love the bottle as well. Yeah. Uh, and also, my middle name's Jade, so Greenstone. It was just like a match made in heaven as soon as I saw this. Uh, yeah, but so, no, so it's probably one of our best sellers at the moment because uh -huh. I love it. So, so, so you're best seller because you're buying it all. Yeah, yeah. yeah secretly. Much, yeah. yeah, yeah. Take it home. Fantastic. Nice. So yeah. get in and check them out. So f just finally to finish this off. Uh, we are in red. Mm -hmm. How's it going for you? What are some things that are happening? Yeah, so when we first went into red, noticed that things were a little bit quieter, but um, with a lot, with some employees working from home. Yep. However, in the last couple of weeks, things have started to pick up again, so that's really good. Mm -hmm. um, we still have our private tastings mm -hmm. happening, and because they're a private group, it's just a group of your friends or your family or your work colleagues, so yep. it's a pretty safe environment. Just a maximum of 20 people. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so basically you just email me to book in a time for that. We also, yeah, we also have a few events actually coming up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, yeah. they will obviously meet yeah. the guidelines of the red level. Um, more info is coming out at the end of this week on that. But Good. basically the week of the, the 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th of March, mid-March, mm -hmm. um, we have a couple of evening events. Uh, Something yeah. to do with blend your own gin. I'll Ooh. leave it there. Okay, okay, I'm in. I'm yeah. sorry. Mark me down. Yes. Um, and online, we can still get stuff yeah. online. Yeah. Yep. So, so we're open twenty four seven online. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Don't worry. Anytime so you want you, it. If you you're can outside, <laughs> if you're outside of Christchurch, you can still get in touch. Yeah. Okay. So let's wrap it up from there. Thank mm -hmm. you very much. These are these are the gins that we know of currently that you know yes. of currently that are giving back in some sort of way. We would love to hear if there are others that have been missed. By all means. Let us know what you would like to know. Would you like to know how to mix and match a good tonic with a yeah. good gin? What are the garnishes that yeah. should be going with it? I've, I've heard of cucumber and pepper for some gins. Mm, yeah. uh, I've just Delicious. come across apple yep. in my gin. Nice. Oh. So let us know some things that yes. you'd be interested to know while we've got Ashley uh, here. And we'll keep you updated with events and stuff that are happening as well. Excellent. Thank you. Thanks, Ashley. Cheers. Thanks. No worries. Okay.